Hello friends, Dollar Tree friends and curl friends. Welcome to day 19 of my inspirational video advent calendar. Today I will be reading Because of Love. And that is written by Anne Cetus. And it's also taken from my Our Daily Bread uh, October, November, December of 2012 booklet. It's another old one. The reason I like this one is because it's large print. <laughs> and I don't need my, oh, I kind of still do need my glasses, but not as badly. So let's go ahead and get into today's reading because of love. I received some nice Christmas gifts last year. Ski pants, a bracelet, and a Kindle reader. But what I enjoyed the most were the gifts of time with people playing with nine grandnephews and grandnieces. Having a niece and her husband and their 18-month-old daughter attend our church's Christmas Eve service with us, visiting with a retired co-worker and his wife who were suffering with some health issues, celebrating the season with longtime friends, reading the Christmas story with loved ones. These were all special gifts because of the love we share. God the Father, because of love, sent a gift to this world 2,000 years ago. Jesus was wrapped in swaddling cloths and laid in a manger. <clears throat> the shepherds knew he was an amazing gift because an angel announced his birth to them in the middle of the night while they were in their fields. They rushed to see him and then couldn't help but share the news of this gift with others. Yet many later rejected him and he was crucified for our sins and buried. But he rose from the tomb and now offers salvation to all who receive him. Thank you God for the gift you gave because of love. Time spent with family and friends is what a lot of people remember. When you think back on Christmas, you think about who you spent it with, you think about the food you ate, uh, you think about what you did in that time, especially if it was fun and enjoyable, and this is just reiterating that. And then um, the biggest gift that we all received was the gift of salvation to everyone who receives him. So if, you're, if you can go out there and buy that and spend some money on it, then that's one gift I would recommend you buying and giving to someone. <laughs> other than that, all that other stuff, it comes and it goes. It's trendy. It's the latest thing. And by the time you buy that one, something new is already coming out. I mean, it's just, it's a trap that they get you locked up in. You get the newest thing and then you want the next newest thing. And you haven't had the newest thing that you just bought for about... A month before the next one's coming out and you're trying to get that one and you get caught up in that little spinning wheel and you're going to find that that's going to be an empty resolve an empty resolution an empty um, life if that's how you choose to live your life is trying to keep up with things that truly at the end of the day have no value so on that note i'm going to close it out here hopefully my rambling made sense because sometimes i just start talking and it's in my head, but it's not coming out right. So hopefully that made sense to you guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's message and stay relaxed, stay calm. Remember, because of love, we all have a chance at salvation. So be encouraged. I'm trying to <laughs> tie in all of the ones I've been reading so far. And I will see you guys tomorrow on day 20. And um, yeah, so see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.